My name is Ryan Ross, and I'm a 2008 graduate of the College of LAS. Since 2015, I've worked for the University of Illinois Alumni Association, where I'm the curator of the Richmond Family Welcome Gallery. The Welcome Gallery is a series of interactive exhibits featuring stories about the history and global impact of the university. As its curator, I collect and share those stories in ways that I think will engage visitors. Having the ability to tell your own story is an important skill to have, not only in your personal life, but in your professional life as well. Storytelling allows potential employers to see that you're more than the words on your resume. It allows you to build connections in meaningful and impactful ways and helps others better understand your point of view. While there are many ways to tell your story, I'd like to share a few helpful pointers using my own professional story as an example. Number one, set the scene. I grew up in central Illinois and the U of I has always been a part of my life. Whether it was as a kid going to basketball games with my dad or in high school reading about faculty research in the local newspaper. After I became an undergrad at Illinois, I got really interested in the university's history. And the longer I was on campus, the more interested and knowledgeable I became. So when I was a grad student here in library science, I was delighted when I got the chance to curate an exhibit about the founding of the U of I. I had never curated an exhibit, but I quickly found that I had a knack for it for using images, objects, and words to tell a story that resonated with people. Several years and several exhibits later, I got the opportunity to come to the Alumni Association as the first curator of the Welcome Gallery. Number two, learn from others. The Welcome Gallery features exhibits on more than 130 topics at a time, everything from student life over the decades and world-changing inventions to alumni achievements, sports, and university traditions. When I curate an exhibit, I'm most interested in stories about the university that capture shared experiences across generations, as well as stories that show how impactful and far-reaching the university has been over the past 150 years, how it's affected people's lives all over the world in ways that we may take for granted. When I'm working on new exhibits, I spend a lot of time reading books and newspapers and looking through records in the university archives, searching for stories and materials that I can display. However, I spend even more time talking with faculty and staff from all over campus, hearing stories about their colleges and departments, and finding out what aspects of the university they're passionate about. And I always learn something new that I can use, something that complements or expands the story I found in the newspaper or the archives. Number three, be genuine. Remember that you have a unique point of view, and only you can express it. The tools I need to do my job the ability to tell stories, to think critically and draw conclusions, and to find connections between what I've learned came directly from my experience majoring in English at Illinois. Being a student here made me a deeper, richer, more humanistic person, and the skills I learned and sharpened as an undergrad I use every day. I feel fortunate to have this platform that allows me to tell stories about the university, to give back to this place that continues to make an impact on all of us, whether we realize it or not. Storytelling is how we make sense of the world. It conveys purpose, sparks empathy, and opens dialogues that connect us with other people. So as you tell your own story, remember to set the scene, share what you've learned from others, and be genuine. And do it with some style.